Hello YouTube, my name is Nero, today we have some more Call of Duty World War 2, welcome back to the campaign playthrough, ladies and gentlemen, today's episode is going to be playing through the campaign mission Death Factory, I don't like that name very much, let's get started. Your orders were to take the hotel, not evacuate civilians. Who decided this was a rescue op? We thought there was time, sir. Last time I checked, Turner was in charge, not you. Is he making the calls now? No, sir. It was my call. It's on me. It's on both of us. Yeah, well, right now, the last thing I should be worried about is if two of my best men can follow orders when we're on the verge of the biggest operation of the entire war. Let me remind you, this is the spearhead of our final drive to the Rhine. Got a whole damn forest to clear so the convoy can get through. So from this point on, I'll accept nothing less than your best. Now get your insubordinate asses ready to move out. It's been three weeks. We're in the Hurricane Forest now, clearing it so the convoy can get to the Rhine. I'm not proud to admit it's taken me this long to open your letter. If it's over, we're here for you, pal. I tried to warn you. College, let the man speak. She's pregnant. Whoa! <laughs> hey, that's huge! All right, Daniels is gonna be a daddy. Yeah. She was trying to let me know, but I wasn't ready to hear it. All right. I could use another cup of Joe. Come on, you mooks, let's give him some space. But I don't want coffee. Sure you do. I'm sorry I waited to tell you about the baby. I tried to the day you were shipping out. The day you took my picture. Everyone gather around. Where's Daniels? Davis is talking. Come on. Uh, on my way. The Hurtkin is dark and nearly impenetrable. Our mission is to take Hill 493. Whoever holds the hill dominates the valley. Now, for lesser men, this task might seem insurmountable. But our division boasts a proud history of firsts. In World War I, we were first to hold off a German attack. First to launch a counteroffensive. First across the Rhine. Nothing has ever stopped us, and nothing ever will. Lieutenant, tell them what we're all about. No mission too difficult, no sacrifice too great. Duty first. I can't hear you. No mission too difficult, no sacrifice too great. Duty first. That's right. Now get ready to move out. Duty first. Back to the old meat grinder. Amen, brother. We move out in five. All right. <laughs> I did not expect us to actually be starting the mission off right here. I absolutely love it when games allow us to do stuff like this, where you can just walk around and just take in the atmosphere. That's something you rarely get to do in Call of Duty campaigns, which is why I think this is one of the best Call of Duty campaigns, maybe even the best Call of Duty campaign. You can actually walk around and get med kits before we even start up the mission, pretty much. That's incredible, but we're supposed to pick up food here. I'm sure there's a memento uh, somewhere here to pick up, but I'm not gonna bother looking for it right now. You got it. Much appreciated, he's overlooking the valley. We're taking food to a soldier here, all right. Little things right here. Little tiny stuff like this I love. It'd be cool if they were to ex expand the headquarters and the multiplayer to be maybe be somewhere like this in the woods somewhere. I don't know, that'd be kind of neat. Morning. Morning, soldier. Compliments of the chef. Only the finest, eh? Thanks, buddy. How's it looking? See for yourself. Those guns aren't letting up. It's been non-stop. I heard you're hitting them today. That's the plan. Good luck out there. Thanks. That is a long ways away. <laughs> like, here to that hill with the flashing on it is where we have to go, apparently. That's pretty incredible. But we need to go rally on Turner. I love the animation of the M1 when your weapon's actually down like this. It looks so good. The M1's one of my favorite guns and pretty much Call of Duty history because it was like the prestigious weapon in World at War. Because you got it at level 65. I think it was 65. It was like the last thing you could actually unlock in your prestige, and therefore nobody was ever able to actually use it because they would prestige pretty quickly, right? 
So once you got 10th prestige, that's when you really started seeing use of the M1A1. All right. Our objective is to eliminate the hilltop artillery so we can hold the forest. First stage is linking up with second platoon at the river. Then we move out. We're going on foot? What kind of resistance are we looking at? The heavy kind. Bridge has been changing hands all day. We're going to help them secure it. But it's really, really Here far away. <laughs> Davis assembled the biggest damned armored convoy ever. Huh. If that don't put the fear of God in them crowds, nothing will. Still a long drive to the right. That's why we need to hammer those guns and keep them alive. Hey, All right, we're, we're going to be riding that, that correct? Because, uh, again, that's a really, really lo uh, long walk. Ooh, we have the whole squad here. You wound back up. Because my Nana, she broke her hip every winter. Do I look like your Nana? Yeah, now that you mention it. Kiss my frozen ass. I'd rather kiss my Nana's. That's a pretty picture. I've always wondered that, because people Everyone say, like, uh, you know, my knee's acting up, must mean rain. But enough people up? actually say it, I feel like Sons maybe it's an actual thing. Us. Next wave could be any minute. All right, first platoon, let's help these boys out. Push up, retake the front line. All right, we're protecting the bridge. All right, grab some mines and get those MGs ready. Barclay, Cooper, advance the bridge and signal when you see movement. Huh. Oh, this is kind of cool. Those Place those mines. So it's kind of like tower defense right now. We're going to hit the artillery at Hill 493. We can't leave our lines exposed. We'll advance to the assembly point once the bridge is secure. Told you by these craters, it ain't going to be easy. <laughs> Easy's not why we're here, guys. All right. We want to plant mines. We'll plant some mines. We'll plant all the mines. I'll keep going until they say we have no more left. Oh, that's it. I was hoping we'd have like an unlimited amount of mines. That'd be so good. Nobody's taken... Alright, how far away do I have these spread out? I'm trying to make them relatively even in terms of spread. The Let's go right there, I guess. Can I grab more? I can grab more. On. They're apparently here. They're apparently here. Oh, okay, this thing fires slow. This is the 1919! This is the Browning! This is the LMG that we really wanted to have in the multiplayer that isn't there for some reason. Okay, I can't, I can't go all the way over that far. I should have been shooting instead of looking at the gun. But the mines are at least going off, so they're doing their job. But they're all pretty go much gone already, so... I guess... Oh, no, never mind. Did I say all the mines were gone? There's still a few more. <laughs> Does that count me? Because I'm kind of in a decent spot, I feel like. I feel like there's, there's a couple people over here to my left, and I don't like that. Oh! Oh! You actually can hold on to the weapon! You can hold on to the browning! Oh, this is so good. This is definitely going to be a DLC weapon. It fires so slow, though. Okay, let's back it up here. Let's back it up. Good thing I grabbed that health pack earlier. Ow, crying out loud. Alright, buddy, I've got you. I think I've got you. You probably just want to go behind this barrel, yeah? Come on over. Anyone else? I thought I saw another icon of somebody needing help. Apparently not. Oh, that's Turner up there. Why didn't I show his name ahead of time? Good thing I missed. Get it? I definitely didn't hit him there. No, I would never shoot Turner. So can I? I can't mount this back up. Like, okay. I don't think I can remount this thing once you once I took it off here. Pop your head up, ugly. There we go. All right, where's Mr. Artillery Man? Oh, Zussman, you're right here. If you're right here, I'd like one of those health packs, please. All right. Where's Pearson? Pearson's all the way up there. Gotta say, I'm not going that far. Where's the... Why are you all the way up there? Why are you all the way up there? If I die trying to grab this... And... Let's get it. I think that was a good throw. Oh, that was a perfect throw. That was a perfect, perfect throw. Oh, they're all retreating now. This gun has so much idle sway and, like, weird recoil. It bounces, like, ridiculously. Hey, Turner, can I give you some ammo? Right here. Right here. First platoon. We're going to split into two teams. We're coming, Pearson, will head north over the bridge to reach the hill. I'll follow the river with the squad to guard your advance. Assembly point will be the base of Hill 493. See you soon. Yeah, you be careful out there. Yeah, you too. 
Did I get the, did, did, did I get that ammo? The thing kind of like overlapped itself because I was talking to multiple people apparently at once. That's why we're guarding Pearson's flank. Can you, can, can you come back? the assembly point, sir. We'll get to the base. They keep cutting out. What is happening with this mission? Can you give me ammo now, please? Thank you. 500 rounds in a little pouch. All right, awesome. I'll keep using this browning, man. 250. Oh, beautiful. Stay low. Wait a minute. <gasps> you have to take them down, but we're outgunned. You gotta probe their flanks. Don't let them see you. Uh, uh, they got rid of my browning. I am so mad. Alright, we're just gonna keep on keeping on, though. I am very upset about this. But we're sneaking through the woods, so... Alright, let's take it seriously. We're just gonna knife this guy. I couldn't tell if I was actually a German or not. At first. Until he lit up and started talking. I guess we can take the car, Ben, huh? On your signal. Oh, are we actually going to straight up ambush him with like... Okay. Well, I assume we hit the gasoline. There we are. Alright, so it's not a one-hit kill. You actually have to hit him in the head. There we go. I'm not a big fan of semi-automatics, but I'll take it. Man, slow I love the slow-mo mechanics of the snipers in the campaign. It's so good. There's literally no way to make that work in the multiplayer, but man, it's really good here in the campaign. That's all of them, isn't it? No. Get this guy back here. Where do you think you're going? How did that not kill you? That was literally in your head. I am. Look at my health bar right now. <laughs> all right. Let's heal up here. Okay. That was absurd. Need some ammo for this carbon here. Yeah. Let's kill off these. Oh. I love how the, oh, the scope flash. That's so good. That's an old school call with the mechanic right there. All right. Let's go ahead and... I didn't realize there were so many of them over here. Okay. Okay. Ow. That hurt a lot. Uh, wait. What gun's on the ground? Wait. Th there's a browning here. I don't know why there's a browning here, but I'm picking it up. Look at this beautiful gun. I love it. Oh, I can mount the LMG. Okay. That would be sick. All right. We need to snipe that guy. What happened to the caravan? What is going on in this mission? Guns are just appearing and disappearing half the time. Why is it here? I have no idea what's happening right now. Okay, let's let's get to killing. Where was the machine gun? Did they already kill him? It's, okay, let's not let uh, Mr. Mr. LMG here set up. There we go. Sometimes you have to hit him twice in the head. Just really depends, it looks like. Falling back, are you? There we go. Yeah, as I was gonna say, those look like friendlies. Okay, so. Right now. M1A1. Carabin, M1A1. It's so weird. You accidentally drop the Browning here. I'm taking the Browning with me, but watch. If I swap my weapon, it automatically drops it. This is weird. Okay, so we're going to have to hold on to this and keep this our primary weapon as long as possible because I want to play with this gun. It's a gun that I hoped would be in the multiplayer, but it isn't, so. Are we supposed to just light him up here? I mean, I can, oh god, the kick on this thing is absurd. It's actually kind of incredible at the same time. Oh! Shit. oh. Shit, it's a trap. We've been spotted. Come on. This is like that World of War mission. With the Japanese. I'd run faster probably if I didn't have the browning, but I'm holding on to her. This is so awesome. It's incredible how far graphics have come in the Call of Duty franchise. I'm very happy I played through World of War before playing this campaign. Oh, can I help you? Oh, no. Nothing can help you. Okay, sorry. I wanted to hopefully drag him or something. I would love it if trees could actually kill you in this. Like, if a tree happens to fall on you, you just happen to die. That'd be hilarious. I don't know if that would happen, though. Oh! Maybe it did. Maybe it did.
Get up, Brad. I know you better than anyone, so I know you still got fight in you. You can't give up. Not now, not ever. Paul? Krauts could be here any second. So show me what you're made of and get on your feet. I'm afraid. I won't make it. You got to, Red. Hazel needs you and so does your child. Now get up. I will. Of course you will. Because you don't know the meaning of quit. I got faith in you, baby brother. Paul. Uh, Paul. Meet me at home, baby brother. I don't think that's an American. Briggs. Oh, it is. Oh, God. You got the stick right in the neck. And everywhere else. All right. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm really dazed. My sensitivity is basically a one right now. All right. Easy enough. My sensitivity is definitely messed up, so we're definitely hurt. Oh, no. Paratrooper got stuck. Jesus. At least there's a health pack under him. Is he actually dead? Yeah, I assume so. Okay. I'm going to keep on sneaking or crouch walking anyway. Don't know exactly where I'm going right now. Oh, shit! <laughs> Alright, stealth. Oh, no. We're about to sneak through a German area. Probably gonna come after their dog. Oh, this is incredible. Alright, so here they are. I wonder if I can lay prone like this here. And then walk by. And not have to go guns blazing. I do have a lot of ammo. So if I do have to go gun blazing, that might actually be alright. But if they have dogs, that's going to be a whole other issue. I hear a dog. What's the toy Shoot. I didn't think he was right there. That's a car. Wait, why am I picking up the car iron sight? The car is terrible in the campaign. I'm supposed to be sneaking through all this. Instead of just killing them all. SVT, that's better than the car, but it's not great in the campaign. <laughs> it's not great in the multiplayer either, but... So far, so good. There might be an achievement for sneaking past them. I don't know. Just going to keep taking it slow. And hopefully not get murdered. All right, checkpoint. Oh no! You think I'm letting them live after that? Think I'm letting them live after taking the flamethrower to him? Oh no! Oh no! That, that that is not how we do things around here. Oh, that's terrible though. Like we surround her. No, please, no! They literally lit him up with the flamethrower. All right, so we're going action here with this. We could go pure stealth with it. All right, maybe action hero might have been a bad idea. I don't have any grenades to throw down. So if I can actually get a shot off before I freaking get hit a bunch, and the flinch is incredible. So the key is to kind of get your shots off before the flinch actually takes effect. Pop your head back up, ugly. I can barely see you down there. There you are. I think I'll see you up here too. Three, four shots so far. The SVT is garbage in campaign. Oh, now he's moving, so he's like, ugh. Turner! Why did I say Turner? Is that Turner over top of the hill? Oh! Yeah, I bet you can stealth through this entire mission. I definitely went loud with it, but uh, I haven't died, so... There's this flamethrower on his back. Ugh, that's rough. He has a bar. I'll take, I'll take his bar. Killed him with the flamethrower. Crying out loud. Oh, there's a little bunker right here. Yeah, I gotta check out the bunker, right? Assembly point's not far. Oh. Our guys are gonna need support. You got it, sir. I didn't think that... Okay, I thought this was like a little side area. I didn't think I'd follow him through here. 
Hey. Of course, I'm the door, man. The door. I got it. I'm surprised one time I'm not just going to open the door and just get shot in the face. Because that's why things are going to happen every time I open the door. I like the bunkers, overgrown bunkers in the woods like this. Reminds me of Wolf's Lair. Ah, just so good. I love it. Looks too run down to provide much defense. Crowd's probably abandoned it. Think they'll be back? Hope not anytime soon. No, this place is super abandoned. Did I see your loud footsteps? Maybe I didn't. Any of our guys out there? No, sir. Hope they made it to the assembly point. I'll check for supplies. Yeah, I wasn't sure if I'm even supposed to go in here, but I want to go in here. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, that's gunfire in the distance. I'm like, maybe it's a, I played too much Fallout or something. I'm like, there's something big in me in here, right? Hope there's grenades and such. I just love, look. Is here a bug? I just love looking through old ruins and stuff like this. This is cool. Why is there a whole thing of grenades in here, though? A little weird, right? Oh, first aid. There we go. I mean, I have so many first aid packs. Let's heal up the full here. Yeah, it's really cool being able to go through and explore through areas like this. I love that. Another SVT. MP40. Oh, there's another door. Oh, yeah, I guess I, I didn't realize you could go right through this doorway right here. Trying to find a memento, but I didn't find any. Let's keep going. Listen. It's water. <gasps> River must be close. I'm praying our boys found cover from that artillery. We'll back them up. Don't you worry. Here's the river. Just gotta follow it to reach the assembly point. And then silence those guns. Sounds like a plan. Oh, look at this. Wonderful. Ooh. Sniper. I see him. him Stay low. Yeah, I'm trying to. I had to run there for a split second and almost died because of it. All right. I have this bar here. All right. Maybe, maybe, maybe instead of just trying to kill the sniper, we should just keep crawling. Oh, look at this. This is cool. Oh. I'm not, allowed, I'm, I'm not allowed to hit him, huh? Because all of those shots should have hit him. Head down. Yeah, I'm aware. But when I saw we were about to take a turn a corner where he can actually hit us, that said to me that we're supposed to Drop kill him. Check the flanks. See if we can reach him. Help! Oh, he's doing the bait. Doing the baby, I shot the guy in the leg or something like that, hoping that we'd go and try and help him. We can't, we, we can't go after him. Just can't do it. Please don't let him actually hit me. So I stay like, because whenever I see, I hear you. We can't go help him. That's what he's trying to do. Pull you in. Sit tight. We'll get him. We need to hurry. How am I supposed to get him? He's at, he's literally doing this on purpose. I'm so gonna die here. Yeah. I need a health pack really badly. <sighs> he's down. Well, he just shot, which is... Wow, he's got multiple people? Yeah, I didn't think so. Why is there not a first aid kit? All right, let's pull out the bar. All right, good. Oh, good. Apparently, I have a first aid kit now, though. That's all I needed. Just a little bit of health. All right, what's my secondary at 1911? Uh, where's, where does MP40 go? What are you... <laughs> that guy picked up the MP40 ammo as he walked over him. This is ridiculous. Get grenades there. Oh, wow. Am I crazy for thinking that was a blurry guy? Uh, I don't 
need any grenades or anything. Is there not more people here? I guess not. Okay. Oh, this is intense. This is intense. Oh! Oh! He was like stuck inside me there for a second. He had toggle action shotgun on, which might not actually be the worst gun in the world right now. I'll keep the MP40 though. Let's heal up. They keep giving me more health packs whenever I kill these guys. I assume it's because it's like dropping off their body. Well, he's not up there. Ooh. Gotta say, a little bit of a jump scare there, but not too bad. I feel like there's more than just him, though. Oh, no. He was, he was, in, the, was he in a strip closet? Okay. Well, let's check this out. Did you see what's up here? Carbon. He's been drinking up here, it looks like. It's very neat. Okay. Let's head downstairs now. Can I get up there? That'd be cool. You can. There's no reason. Oh, there's a memento up here. That's cool. That's cool. I love exploring stuff like this. It's so cool. All right, let's go. Area is clear. Is it? That soldier didn't have to die. Let's move. Assembly point's not far. Hope our guys got there okay. Well, maybe you should have risk, risk, or got out there and got him, huh? Risk your butt for a change, Turner. I had literally like five health. <laughs> and I'd already been shot. You want me just to jump out to my death? I'm supposed to be crouching right now or not, but we're going to do it anyway. Okay, I wish I would grab that carabin now. Which ones are which? I assume these are... How many shots does it take, man? And there's three down right there. The AMG guy, I can probably get right now. There's four shots and he's down. Top down. Oh, no trouble. No trouble at all. I think we'll honestly be fine here. This is, this is easy stuff compared to what we've seen. All right, so I decided to cut those out from this episode here. I had many deaths in a row there. Thanks to some really, really stupid things happening. So check out this clip right here. This is Turner, me begging him for ammo. Meanwhile, he's just standing in the middle of the line of fire from the machine gun. That was really silly, if you ask me. So that's an annoying death. I've had a couple of other ones. This area of the campaign, for some reason, is rather difficult. I did not expect this one little area of the mission to be, like, ridiculously hard for one reason or another. But we're going to try and take it slow and move forward and just hopefully get through this area. we got to move pretty quickly, I think, but not too quickly. I need to get some ammo from Turner before we can really do anything. What do you think you're doing, mister? Now, that looks like a friendly right there, but definitely not right there. Can I get him through the wall? There we go. All right, Turner's ready to give me ammo. So, Turner, where are you? You're right here in front of me? All right. Yes, please. Thank you. Can I just have ammo now? There we go. All right. Now we're good. Now we're in business. I heard a grenade, so I'm waiting for that to blow up. There it is. All right. Let's go. Hello. What do you think you're doing here, friend? With your car 98K iron sight. Thank goodness you guys use, like, the worst guns in the entire game. Oh, did, did you see his helmet fly off? That was incredible. Anything over here? No? Okay. We'll push up here when I'm good and ready. Okay. Let's get out the MP40. Oh, I get the machine gun guy up here. And no more of you. Where are your friends? I've been waiting a long time to do this. Like I said, I've died many times so far in this mission. That's the last of them. Good job, Daniels. Squad, fall in at the bridge. We'll hold the mill as a staging ground. When Pearson gets here, we'll advance to the assembly point. On my way, sir. Not another bridge. <laughs> they captured an M1 Grand here. It's got a grenade launcher on it, which is kind of neat. 
It's always fun uh, messing, messing around with like uh, guns or attachments or what have you that weren't uh, in the multiplayer. But I want the M nope. I want the M wait. Can I do? Oh wait, hold on here. You take the MG, dismount the MG. Bam, MG forty two. Nice and easy. But there's not a whole lot of ammo in it, so it's kind of cool that we can do this. But you know, we're just gonna go ahead and grab the MP forty back. Where'd that go? Where did the MP forty go? Okay, there it is. And there it is. Okay. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh. Pfft. Come on, guys. Let's get going. Snipers, get cover. Well, I guess we should use the uh, grenade launchers now, huh? I don't know if I consider this to be in the open. Hey, there we go. That's a good shot. My noob tubing skills are coming back to me. I played a lot of Modern Warfare 2. Oh, hit marker. Where's my teacher close? All right. Wait, I killed somebody, but apparently not that sniper. Nope, sniper's dead now. And we'll see if we can hit him there. Nope, I need to aim higher than that. Whatever. Now I think about it, let's just use the M1 Grand. One shot headshots are freaking incredible. What are they? Oh, just the health pack here. Oh, I can just flip that over. Okay. Okay, this might be a tough spot to actually hold. I've got plenty of ammo right now, Turner. Thank you. Let's grab this carbon, actually, and use this. I don't think I actually hit him there, but it's okay. Wait, will you just die already, friend? Thank you. Yeah, 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 you and your ammo. It's fine. I got people to kill that doesn't involve your ammo. Path track where? Okay. Oh, I just missed. Okay, I need you not to hit me. Did I kill him or I used to just hit marker him? Oh, he's dead. Good. Oh, man. The, the slowing down of time is fantastic. Let me get your... Oh, no. Let me get your buddy here. Pop your head up. There we are. All right. Sorry. I won't, I won't pop up anymore. <laughs> so far, this mission is incredible. It's very long, but it's awesome. I need some ammo. That'd be great. Awesome. Oh, God. How many of these guys are there? Oh, okay. They're retreating to the half-track. How did that not hit him? Or maybe it did. All right, so far so good, I suppose. If we hold this position until Pearson gets here, then we take the hill together. Unless he bypassed the mill and went for it himself. He doesn't have the manpower. <laughs> it's never stopped him before. He said we wait here, and that's what we're gonna do. No disrespect, sir. But what if Styles was right and Pearson did go ahead? You let me worry about that, Daniels. My gut tells me something's off. If I made decisions based on your gut private, we'd still be on the boat at Normandy. Exactly. You heard how Pearson's platoon got wiped out at Kasserine? Looks like history's repeating itself. It better not. <laughs> I want to know what really happened there. Yeah. Well, I don't have the guts to ask Turner. But I know someone who does. <laughs> 